So after the first two quarters of this game, the Milwaukee Bucks and the Philadelphia 76ers have fought a well battled game. It's been even both ways. Both teams have been phenomenal so far. Brandon Knight and the Milwaukee Bucks have been killing it from deep as well as Jabari Parker just doing everything offensively tonight. And through two quarters going into the third quarter, the Bucks have the lead. So without further ado, let's get right into the gameplay. So here we are in the third quarter. The Milwaukee Bucks got a five-point lead as Jabari Parker swoops to the lane, getting the layup right there. So in the intro, I showed you a picture of my roster, and I got to say, I've made this team a pretty deep team offensively. But wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Sondra gets the rebound. Kicks it up to Middleton. Middleton, alley-oop to Turner. Yeah, but as I was saying earlier, I mean, we've got Evan Turner and Giannis Antetokounmpo coming off of the bench. Two players who could be starting for pretty much any other team in the NBA. So, I mean, this team is pretty strong. I mean, we're just working, honestly, on our defensiveness and just experience. I mean, the Milwaukee Bucks are by far the youngest team in the NBA. Our oldest player on this team is at 28 years of age, so really a young team. And Joel Embiid in this game was huge for the 76ers. I mean, just crashing that offensive board, getting a bunch of offensive putbacks, and it was just hard to stop. So 87-86, pretty nice hooping through the lane, getting the dunk right there, giving us a one-point lead. We had the lead early in the fourth quarter, but the 76ers just fought back and got the lead. So Jabari's going to tie the game up at 90, and right there, Tony Roten is going to get the shot. Tony Roten is so overpowered in this game. It's unbelievable, but Sullinger's going to hit a clutch shot right there. Sealing the game right now, giving us a three-point lead with a minute left in the game. But Michael Carter-Williams, you can't stop that backhand layup. 94-95. We find Sanders. Wait, no, it gets stolen. Balamute is going to take the ball all the way to the rack for the nice layup right there. Giving the 76 is a one-point lead. So 24 seconds left. Jabari gets fouled on the shot right there. Joel Embiid is out. Hit the road, Jack. Joel Embiid that. fouls out, but Nerlens Noel. Ah, oh, he gets fouled by Larry Sanders right there. Almost hit the shot, but we still have a one-point lead in this game. So Noel is going to miss the first free throw. Whew, take a breather. It's all good. Second free throw, and it is no good. Sondra with the rebound. We just got to get a quick basket. We get fouled right there with Jabari. Come on, Jabari. These are the biggest free throws of your NBA career. Knocks down the first one. And he would knock down the second one. So five seconds left. Carter Williams to Rowan, Rowan for three, and he gets it to go. Tying the game at 99, we are heading into OT. In overtime, Tony Rowan hits a fadeaway jump shot right there, and he, just Tony Rowan taking over, getting the dunk right there, man. They, Tony Rowan and the 76 who just killed us here in overtime. Jabari, I just forced up a jump shot right there, somehow goes in. I'm playing on superstar difficulty with simulation slider, so... I mean, it's not the hardest, but it's definitely not the easiest. Sanders trying to get something to go, finally gets a bucket in. So we have a one-point lead. This game isn't over yet. OJ Mayo puts up a three, gets it to go. These threes were just falling for us like crazy, but 14 seconds left. Michael Carter-Williams at the line. He will hit the first free throw. Gives him a one-point lead. He will end up hitting the second. No, misses the second. Jabari with the rebound. I can't call a timeout. It's not letting me. Jabari calls for the pick, and Jared Sullinger gets the personal foul right there and that would seal the deal for the 76ers oh what a heartbreaker man we could have had that game we were one point away from at least a double overtime two points away from winning this game but yeah that is the episode hope you guys enjoyed let's smash 75 likes if you want to see another episode tomorrow